Hello. Yes, I'm recording. All right. So iPhone 6s Plus today. Um, this came in. Uh, the lady had dropped it and lost her image. Um, and so, you know, like any technician, you do the first thing first, try another screen. Uh, new screen didn't work in this case. I even grabbed a known good screen because uh, I've been getting some crappy parts lately and I ordered the highest quality I can from my distributor, um, which they, they state is original. Uh, I don't know how true that is, but they say it is. Um, and I mean, it has all the, the telltale signs that it is original, um, or at least refurbished original. Um, so came in, uh, no image, tried a new screen, tried a known good broken screen, uh, still no image. Uh, there was backlight though. Um, so then basically I just went around and started testing. Um, let's pull up ZXW here. So ZXW is a good tool. So you can just start clicking on different pins and see exactly where they run. Um, so I just went through and started uh, testing and on our fourth pin here on our digitizer LCD connector uh, which is PP1VA LCM connection uh, runs to uh, filter FL4205 uh, and that's uh, what we're testing. We're testing the filters um, no shorts, you can test for shorts if you want. Uh, there, there wasn't any. Uh, so it went and tested the filter. So I, I put a probe on this pin right here, and then a probe over on my filter. One side of the filter, um, and what I was doing was testing continuity mode just to make sure it was still a wire. Uh, there was uh, continuity on one side, the other side, well, there was nothing. That means my filter, um, the wire severed in, in the inside of it, and it's no longer making a bridge. So what I do, I grab the donor board, replace that filter tried the original screen still no image uh, doesn't mean that uh, it's not working though so then we're gonna grab our known good screen and that's what I did I put the known good screen on it so let's go back here so you can see me again so I put a known good screen on it And try it again. And look at our image is back. So it's that simple. Just replace the filter and replace the screen. Um, so we're going to get this phone kicked out of here today. Um, and that's why it's really important to get into board repair because if something like this walks into your shop and you're just doing general repair you try a new screen that doesn't work and you're like sorry you got a board defect and you send them on their way and you don't even tell a customer hey there's other shops doing these types of repairs um i mean who wants to go spend another 600 dollars on a phone all i did is replace a part and it cost me any money i mean granted that does need a new screen so she so that's going to cost you some money the screen but replacing that you get charged for that i mean it's your knowledge it's your labor um you know it's your equipment if, if, i mean if you don't got this this stuff you know your soldering station your fucking microscope if you don't have this stuff you can't you can't do it so you uh you get to charge a little bit extra for you know doing a repair that costs you any money because uh you put the money and the time and to learn in the stuff. And so that's how you get rewarded. You, you get a charge for it. Um, so I think that's about it for this video. <laughs> nice little short video. Um, I've been doing a lot of repairs, not on video, just so I can focus more. Um, Cause I've been coming across some weird stuff. Uh, this, this week has been, been really weird. Um, but after I figured it out, then I want to kind of make a video, show you what I did, how I, how I figured it out. Um, hopefully help you out a little bit. I know a lot of you like to actually watch a, f a full repair. Um, since I'm only me in the shop and I run a general repair store as well, uh, I get interrupted a lot. So it'd make for a really, you know, in and out video. 
and when I can actually like get an employee in here that can actually run the store and I can start working from home or something um, I'll start doing you know full-length videos um, just strictly repair uh, and try to stay away from the bullshit to keep them keep them short for you guys um, but yeah that's it for this video thanks for watching